how to conserve marine life in the Atlantic Ocean. That's what delegates at this conference need to discuss. High on the list is the protection of severely depleted stalks of bluefin tuna, shotfin mako and pro beagle sharks. The discussions will have a crucial impact on many fishermen in Cape Town. It's important in this country that conservation efforts towards our marine life is taken because there's many countries in the world where the marine life is being totally abused by authorities, by other foreign vessels and if South Africa puts in a good drive to conserve the fish it'll be a good thing you know we as fishermen enjoy catching the fish so we don't want our, our fisheries and our stocks depleted. According to research the actual catch of Atlantic bluefin tuna exceeded quotas by 57 percent between 2008 and 2011. We really need to control illegal fishing to make sure that the quotas are actually protecting the species in the way that they're intended. Local fishermen say that all the talking about conservation on land will have little impact at sea without proper patrols, enforcing quotas and protecting stocks. The first thing that should be done is that one should look into patrolling, having more security out there because foreign vessels, they come into our interna from international waters into our local waters and they obviously, we can stand on land and talk about it and discuss it but it's what's happening at sea that actually is the problem. Many local fishermen are disillusioned about conservation efforts. Everything the government decides fall on the small men. We have to, how can I say, cough up at the end of the day because they're protecting this and they're protecting that. So the effect falls on us. Then you get, they become closed areas where we can't fish because of conservation of other species. And it's not just the tuna under threat. Delegates will be discussing how to create catch limits for Marco and blue sharks. These sharks have little protection and are often overfished. Our team Tongana, Cape Town. News that moves. ENCA.com.